tick checks are a must. May is uh, Lyme Disease Awareness Month. And you know, there's not too many things that really unnerve me, uh, but disease carrying ticks do. And for those of you who follow me on Instagram or Facebook, and I hope you guys do, the you know, the tags are in the notes. Um, I spend a lot of time outside, whether it's training myself or training with the boys or fishing or hiking, you name it. And um, over the last couple years, I've certainly seen an uptick in the number of ticks around. Uh, our dog Duncan has had ticks on him. Uh, I've seen ticks roaming around me and the boys. Uh, in fact, Kellen and I both had ticks attached to us in the past. Now, locally with the dog, they might be, uh, they may not be deer ticks, but they still carry disease as well. The deer ticks carry Lyme disease, uh, but you wanna be aware. So just a couple tips with uh, Lyme and ticks. Uh, on my keychain, I carry a tick key at all times. Uh, tickkey.com it's good to have around in the house at least or maybe in the car uh, topical deterrents i like neem from neem tree farms and i like lemongrass from atlantic.ca uh, both of them are in the notes so you could order them uh, but take it serious i've helped people get over lyme disease diagnosis and i'm sure you've seen all over the internet people really struggling with lyme disease bartonella and other diseases that these little gross critters carry. Uh, the one last other tip I would have is when you're outside or hiking, I think it's a good idea to wear light clothes because when you're walking through the woods or fishing, um, if you get ticks on you or a tick on your clothes, it's easier to see them when you're wearing something light as opposed to dark because those critters are dark. I hope these tips help you think a little bit about tick awareness. It's important as always. Uh, be awesome and never unawesome. Bye.